So a lot of people who are new to the trucking industry find themselves in this position to where they've, they've finally got themselves backed up, but the dock plate can't go in because you are not the both sides of the trailer are not flush up against the, the bumpers of the dock. All right, now, a lot of times, and then when you once you start fixing it, you know, you end up not, you end up being parallel, but you end up being moving over. Now, there's two options, all right? First option is going off to the right, all right? So we're going to do this nice and slowly. There we go. Now, once we're parallel, we're going to stop and analyze the situation of what is going through my head. Okay, now, once we did go off to the right, as you can see, the trailer ended up going off to the left. Well, it's just, it just—it didn't really. It just ended up rotating. Okay. Now we're going to go forward. Now we could straighten up round now, but I think we can just let's go ahead and just point our steer straight for just a few feet. We're going to go forward. And now, why? When do I start turning to the left here? All right. Basically. I'm trying to move my trailer, kind of scoot it over a little bit, but I can't wait till it gets to the line. If I wait till it gets to the line, by the time I do start going off to the left, it'll be all the way past this line. So I'm gonna go ahead and th turn roughly around here, and I may change my mind. This, I'm gonna analyze it right here. Where are my axles versus the uh, the trailer? Sorry, where are my axles versus these lines? And I think they're in a pretty good place, because when I go off to the left, the trailer is going to keep moving to the right, all right, at least shifting over, okay? All right, so let's keep going to the left. And we're not going to wait till it's parallel, because if we wait till it's parallel to straighten up, um, we'll, it, won't, it won't be parallel anymore, okay? So let's go ahead and let's go forward. I'm going to turn roughly around here. All right, let's keep going to the right. Okay, so this is looking a lot better. Let's take a look of where we're pointing towards uh, our trailer. So, okay, it's po definitely pointing in a lot better place. All right, because now all we can do, we can fix that in reverse. Okay, so we want the back of the trailer to go a little bit to the right. So I'm going to start off turning slightly to the right to get our rear end pointing to the left. All right, okay. There we go. And then we can just, you know, do small little maneuvers. Now, once we get this backed up, I'll show you the other way to do it. Now, the other way is better to fix if we have a lot less room in front. All right, and I'll show you why okay, in just a second. Okay, I know, I'm done with that. Now, um, there is more distance as you from from this point here to uh, to this point, or from or, or let, let's say let's say let me let's just back up all the way for a second. Okay, there is more distance between here and here than there is from here and here. So we can take advantage of this room. Just, just so in whatever situation you're in, all right, just remember there's more space between here and here than there is in here and here. So that way you can actually maneuver more. Anyway, okay, so let's go ahead and do the other one that I was talking about, or I haven't talked about yet, but I will. So now we're just gonna drive straight. Instead of going off to the right, we're just gonna drive forward, okay? And uh, as you can see, we're, we're always gonna be pointing towards uh, where we were, no, no maneuvering has happened yet, but now we're gonna go off to the left. As you can see, going off to the left has moved my, uh, has, is pointing my trailer into a different point, and that's exactly where I wanted it to be pointing towards. Because now all I have to do is get my steers pointing straight, and now, again, we're gonna do a straight back. All right, now, I'm not, as you, you're gonna see in a second, all right, let's go ahead and just stop it right here. Um, we're gonna go past, our trailer has to go past this this yellow this white line, all right? Because if we start trying to maneuver it right now, um, it'll it'll be off. As in, like, uh, it'll be it'll go back to the left again. So we're gonna go. We're gonna keep driving straight, trying to drive straight. There we go. And we're gonna now the next part we gotta do is get our trailer parallel to the line or pretty close to it. So we're gonna go ahead and turn to the right now, hard, all right? Because you and the, the, it will maneuver in the least amount of distance, the more you turn your steering wheel. So let's keep backing up to the right, okay. Now, as you can see, it's gone past it. Now it's gonna be coming back towards it. Now, if I wait till it's parallel, let's go ahead and wait till it's parallel for now. Okay, it's perfect, it's lined up, but the truck isn't, all right? So let's go right back to where we were, okay? Uh, roughly around here. So this is basically where you should, should start chasing. Okay, turn all the way to the left. And let's keep our reverse going. 
and okay we're gonna just keep it keep it going and stop all right so it's not perfect but it's good enough if we, let's say we go off to the right we can fix this in a really in a really short distance so we're gonna turn all the way to the right and then back all the way to the left and stop get our ears pointing straight and then back up to the dock all right that's two ways to fix that little problem